Uh, played some right. Rosetta Stone. Did my online interaction. With Tell me about. So I feel like this. Let's let's back this story up a little bit. Sure. Uh, Drew and I went to. Uh, we got contact. You got contact. We were invited to a Rosetta Stone <laughs> event last month. Last yeah. month. No, la- I don't, earlier. It feels like ages ago. Last month, we were invited to a how Rosetta this, Stone. How did this happen? Uh, a, a PR agency that that represents certain other uh, game entities. Okay. All right. Okay. Uh, like people within our within our business. Yeah. I guess we got on the mailing list for Rosetta Stone. Great. And was the thing was sent to me. Said, "Hey, we're having an event in San Francisco," and I like half jokingly forwarded it to I think to Drew. It's Drew, yeah. Because Drew's because really Drew, because Drew it, uses yeah. Rosetta Stone. He's mm. using using it to to learn German. German yeah. Uh, I know he's serious about it. So I'm like, hey, if, if, hey, if you want to go to this Rosetta Stone event, they're going to show off the new Rosetta Stone. And then he was like very, he's really he was very, and he's like, yeah, I want to go to this. How do we, like, what, let's, how do we set this up? What do we do? And then uh, and I was like, oh, and then like the week of, he's like, well, what are we, are we doing this? And I was like, All right, Drew, <laughs> if you want to go, let's go. And then uh, I, I, you tried to get me to go, and I said, I have zero right. business. And going I've used to this Rosetta thing. Stone before, too. Uh, yeah. So Drew and I went, and it was great. I, <laughs> I really like the new version of Rosetta Stone. They showed off that new version of Rosetta I'm gonna, Stone. I'm going to shill right here for Rosetta Stone. Thank you for inviting us to the event, and it's a great new product and the uh, one of the greatest things about it. And and I, and I tell this because uh, the PR agency wound up contacting contact us. I was like, you going to review Rosetta Stone? <laughs> I said, we're not qualified to review Rosetta yeah. Stone in any way, but you know, like uh, we're using it, and it's great. And we've got a copy of the Japanese one. Yeah, yeah, you got me that copy of the Japanese one, which uh, has been sitting uh, in front of my TV for over cra- a week. At now, some point, we should crack yeah, it open, and, and I, take I, a I do kind of want to, you know. I, I've, right. I've talked a lot of game about like you know I would I love placed, to learn I placed Japanese that on your someday. desk specifically because right. I thought yeah. you would you would so that's what, to, that's what we were you know that's when we went to the event we were like oh you know like we've been talking about maybe learning yeah. Japanese or whatever and uh, they're great here to Japanese uh, so I've been I've been using it for Italian for a while and uh, one of the new things that's new to Rosetta Stone it, wouldn't it be like if I was just using it for English no my Italian is terrible <laughs> it, it's it's not good at all okay. Uh, and but you, but you have enough that you're able to critique some of the translations in Assassin's Creed Brotherhood. Yes, like Vive la France is yeah. not Montreal, which Montreal is way funnier. Yeah. Uh, Although I did I did the legwork. Montreal did not exist until the mid 1600s. So you looked it up. I did. Okay. Uh, what part of France are you from? In Assassin's Creed, and Ezio answers Montreal. Ah, um, He's posing as a French troop. Yeah. But in the Italian version... But in my game, says, he was stuck in Altair's armor, so he was not posing as a French troop. <laughs> really? He didn't change? I, I couldn't turn it off. Oh, no. Like it, it was, I could, You could set it, oh, and I would go back play... and pick plain cape or something like that, but he would never change out oh, of it. So when I got to the missions where he was supposed to be disguised, oh, it just like broke. the play, oh, and the other, it, just, like, it just was broke. And, and I, could, I couldn't figure out what was going on for a little while. It's like, wait, why am I... That's sad. Like, oh, okay. That's the actually a cool broken. part. Yeah. Um, so on the Rosetta Stone, a new thing is uh, all this online stuff. And then they showed us a little bit uh, of this at the demo. But you basically sign up for appointments. You schedule an appointment Whoa. with a real teacher, like a teacher that's online. So they give you a list, like, when do you want to sign up? And it's an hour long. Uh, and they, they have video of them. horrifying. It's terrifying, but it's great. Uh, so at the end of, like, your coursework for, like, the, the first chapter or first, like, unit, let's say, uh, you schedule a thing, and I'm sitting there. I'm like, I, my wife is sitting next to me. I'm like, I'm gonna do it. She's like, you should totally do it. I'm, like, I'm gonna do it T- tomorrow morning at 9:30. So I did it, and um, woke up, and it was about 20, uh, 20 after nine. And I click it, uh, and roll up sitting there in my PJs. My wife sitting next to me because she's excited for me. I'm nervous. She's yeah, like, yeah. Oh, this is gonna be awesome. Like, I don't want to do this. <laughs> I, I'm terrible. And uh, I put on my headphones. I put on the headset, and uh, it's the loading bar starts going because it's getting near. And this little video pops up of this woman who looks as if she's of, uh, let's say, like Middle Eastern descent. Uh-huh. I'm like, oh, this is gonna be weird. She doesn't look Italian at all. Mm-hmm. And she goes, "Hi, welcome to Rosetta Stone. I'm your uh, counselor guide, and we just want to go over a few of the rules for going to this thing." I'm like, oh, okay, a little pre-recorded video you get sure. before it starts. And she's like, "You're gonna stay in English the entire time, and uh, try not to if you gotta take." Take a break. Use the mute button and stuff like that. And if there's anybody else with you, please be considerate because you're supposed to be in groups of other oh. people. Please be considerate. And then she goes, "Did you get all that?" <laughs> yes. <laughs> She's like, "Great." I was like, "Oh yeah, you're real." <laughs> and then she, I'm going to push you through to Maria, your teacher. And then it goes off for a second, and then Maria comes up in the corner and she's like, "Ciao, Vincent." <laughs> and then I freaked out. I was just like, like "Ah." Oh! Hello, I couldn't talk. <laughs> it's like, uh, 
<laughs> but it was it was uh, so I was the only one in there. Oh, so, yeah. uh, but fifty minutes one on one with Maria, and it was it was fantastic. It was great, and uh, I was super nervous and fidgety, and uh, she couldn't see any of that. She mm-hmm. just heard me in the headset. But um, you know, I just Wait, had you hold on. You didn't have a webcam set up as well. They don't let you. And it was, it was we asked about that in the thing. Like no webcam. She's, they're like no, <laughs> <laughs> no, no. They, we, so, but they, so they're just getting the voice. They're just getting the voice. I see her, mm-hmm. uh, which is important because she's pantomiming a lot of stuff. Uh, yeah. But man, like that that learning a language uh, with with human contact is is the way to go. It's the only it, way. It's the only way, right? And like the fact that they've added that in, uh, and there's more online stuff like that. Uh, is like a huge That's step crazy. for that product. Right. So like I can reschedule. I could do that every day of the week if I wanted to. Well, it's crazy that, that it's just part of like the software package that it's not like well, some subscription. It's an, it's an, it's an, it is. It is. It is okay. an online. You you can buy just the CDs or you can pay the subscription fee for it. I think it's like 14 months is like 150 bucks or something like okay. that. Okay. So, uh, so after that. I was blown away. I was like, that was fantastic. That is, if you're going to learn, it was terrifying, but that's what you have to go right, through, right? Yeah, you have yeah. to interact with somebody at some point. And my wife was like, I want it. So I was like, great, let's go look. And uh, yeah, we were going to sign her up for her own because I, yeah, yeah. I was you do it. She's like, I can't do it. I want to do it. I want to take her headset and do it. Um, she, she, just wanted, wanted, she just wanted to do it on your account. Yeah, she was just wanting so, so is there like persistence with that stuff? Are they like tracking like, like level four? Yeah. Yeah. Well. Yeah. Now I'm on you. Have, have you unlocked perks? Yeah. Is there damage yet? Yeah, did you get the red dot? Uh, no. But uh, but they do have like little achievements that come up in the corner oh. that are just like, uh, Vinny's completed uh, an online lesson. Like Sherilyn's completed getting started, and like little things that like kind of tick up at the bottom there. Nice. So all sorts of weird online stuff uh, that have made the product better. But uh, that one-on-one interaction is it's crazy. freaking terrifying. Crazy. And I was doing a language which I'm slightly familiar with. Like if I were doing the Japanese. Forget it. I mean, they are patient and everything, but like something about second language, like as an adult interacting with people scares the crap out of me. I just feel like I'm the worst. Like I'm 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 talking like an idiot. I'm talking like an idiot. You, I know you're the most patient person in the world. I'm sorry. (laughs) I'm so sorry. I can't even imagine what this sounds like to you right now. Like all my like gender agreements. Okay. Right. It's like, oh, uh, like, okay, yeah, all right, is good. Is it is it going to be okay? Sure, yes. Use your prepositions. There um, you go. But anyway, yeah, I did I did a bunch of that, and uh, yeah, I can barely handle <laughs> English. It was a lot of fun. So there you go. Get uh, think about Rosetta Stone for your second <laughs> language needs. If you need terrifying experiences, it's consider really, Rosetta Stone. It's really the only way, though. Like Red Brad said, it's the only way uh, because you when you do the computer stuff, it's like. You're speaking to it, and like you're saying something that should be that you're like, well, this is right, and the computer's looking for an exact oh, string yeah, of yeah. words and stuff. Whereas with the person, they're like, yeah, okay, I see what you're getting at, but here's how you should really do it, mm-hmm. you know? Uh, but yeah, I don't know. That was that was probably the most fun game I had. Brotherhood was great. <laughs> but, uh, from a from a well, it sounds like you had getting to, my heart rate going. I was gonna say it sounds like you had a fantastic online experience. I did. I don't play online games, but uh, I might go back for more. <laughs> but Rosetta Stone. Uh, and then, yeah, so that that was pretty much my thing. I didn't. Is, leave, I did you, not leave the house. Is is Drew? Do you know if Drew's using the new Rosetta Stone for his uh, German, or if he's still? It's funny. The old he's, one. he's worried that the installing a new program will overwrite his progress in in his old Rosetta Stone. Oh, okay. So uh, he has to see if he can import his save basically in a, in a new one because uh, he's pretty. You can far import wrong. your character, <laughs> yeah. And you know, you kind of get all the, the gold and stuff. Right he away. wants to see if he can import his level because uh, you don't want to grind out the beginning stuff again. Well, it's like an extra ten bucks to do a server transfer. So. I guess that's fair. Change your name. Yeah. Uh, it was fun. I don't know. Uh, and, and, you know, I talked to my uh, my mother-in-law, who's actually a second language teacher, mm-hmm. and she's like, where's that stones? Put us all out of work. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I bet. Right. She's probably hates that they've added this element no, to it. She's super nice, and she was just kind of, you know, she was like, oh, yeah, you know, I'm, I'm glad you're using it because, you know, it gives me a great perspective on, you know, what's new in it. And, like, you know, I talked to a lot of other teachers because she does, like, uh, uh, like what are those things called? Like big summits or whatever, like that. And they talk about, you know, schools that are shutting down their second language program, and they're like, "Well, we can buy copies of Rosetta Stone and give those to the kids and stuff oh, like yeah, that." Yeah. And it's like, "Is that a good idea or not?" And she's like, "Okay, interesting, interesting." <laughs> <laughs> Chagrin to hear that it's not entirely awful. Yeah. Well, no, not really. I mean, she's just she's curious. She wants to see what's mm-hmm. going on. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Well, if you want to do that. Mm-hmm. Fine. Jeff Gerson. Hi. <laughs>